the pyramids were not uh, sarcophagus, they were not graves and, and tombs, they were power stations. They powered the entire city based on energy, based on water, based on sun. They were made as coils, they were insulated with rocks and limestones and granite and water would flow under the pyramids and the sun would hit the water and it would go under and it would release its electrons under mm -hmm. and the structure of the pyramid would take the energy and then send that out for their services and for whatever they needed. So it means these structures and it's so advancedly built that it can't be destroyed by either a flood or earthquake. Where now we build buildings that fall down. So what was that technology? But by people of the heart and by people of meditation. Now that they use only their head, what did it get them? Alzheimer's, right? Because they fry the circuit of the head, they, they put too much emphasis on their head and by 80 years old the head no longer can take the, the, the energy that they're putting into the circuitry. So Allah describes them like donkeys carrying books because you have to keep all these books with you everywhere you go to remind yourself what you learned. But the alim and those who make tafakkur and contemplate, there's no books for them. What they learn is in their heart. What Allah conveys is within the heart, there's no series of books to put down.